Okay, Tony Rivera, wake up call. When you had too much to drink and you're not in the airport, it's time to say, you know something? This is a wake up call. We was inside the uh, airport and uh, in a bar, raising hell, and uh, he was being taken to a drunk tank for four to six hours. But uh, I'm a, I quit drinking a few years back. It's one day at a time, but you have to consider this is a wake up call. No, no matter what happens in your life, a death, something like that, you can always uh, deal with it. You got two years now without a drink. Just uh, take it one day at a time. AA is really good for the stories. I, can go, I go to AA when, I'm, when I get weak. But uh, when you find yourself in uh, custody of the police at an airport, that's got to be a wake-up call. It's got to be. It's one day at a time. Thank you. You can always go get help, like I did. I went to, I went to AA for a couple of years. Uh, I had 18 years once and I relapsed. So you can always relapse, but I, you should not. You shouldn't relapse. You should, you should basically just try to take one day at a time. So hopefully this is a wake up call for the gentleman, and uh, he'll, he'll get some help and quit drinking. It's a disease. I had a death uh, last week, uh, about two weeks ago. My girlfriend died. I was very, very depressed, but I knew drinking would not be the answers. So I didn't have a drink, you get to learn how to deal with the pain. With help from your family. Or AA. Or some uh, alcoholic program. I will be an alcoholic the rest of my life. And I always try to deal with it one day at a time. But this gentleman should realize it's gotta be a wake up call. I'm doing a whole series on uh, alcohol, how bad it is for you, and you actually don't need it. So if you do find yourself anywhere and there's cops involved, or whether it's a DUI, or right. so, uh, airport, and it's over alcohol, it's time to quit. Alcohol doesn't make things better. When Kobe Bryant passed away with his daughter, I got the news my, my girlfriend died, and it was devastating. But uh, I didn't take a drink. I knew that would make it worse. So if you uh, have a problem drinking, seek help. I love AA because people get up and tell their stories about how they lost everything. And that's how I quit. I went to AA, man, you know. I don't go to AA every day. I go once in a while, I have to deal with life, rent, you know, a lot of different problems that I have that I know alcohol will make things worse. So hopefully this guy gets the help he needs, because uh, this is not a good thing. So they do have a drunk tank here, not here, but outside the airport, to keep you from four to six hours until you sober up. I blame a lot of the, uh, the bars at the airport because you realize these people should be cut off at a limit. Sometimes they drink before they get here. So hopefully this guy gets the help he needs. If you have a problem, pay the AA or some place that will give you the proper help. Tony Barrett is signing off here at LAX.